The President of the United States faces a country divided on many of the big issues. Immigration, foreign policy, the economy. These are just some of the obstacles that the Trump administration will have to tackle. For many, however, there is one looming issue that has risen above all others in importance. How will Donald Trump deal with the colossal $20 trillion debt racked up by the federal government? When the government doesn't have enough money to meet its obligations, it borrows cash to pay the bills. This running total is the national debt, and it has been accumulating for decades. In earlier days, debt was increased by modest amounts. But more recently, the debt has increased by at least $1 trillion during each of the last five presidencies. This includes nearly $10 trillion added between 2009 to 2017 during the Obama administration. The total debt today? Over $20 trillion, the highest it's ever been. And it's burdensome by pretty much any metric. Using debt to GDP. The U.S. has the eighth highest debt of advanced economies at 104%. On a per-person basis, each person in the U.S. owes $61,300, the second highest in the world. Per taxpayer, however, that amount balloons to $167,000. But by using debt to revenue, a ratio comparing debt size to federal tax dollars, the U.S. ranks number two in the world at an extraordinary 979%, second only to Japan. So what does Trump think of all this debt business? At the start of his campaign, he said that debt would be a top priority for his administration. According to Trump, the U.S. was becoming a large-scale version of Greece and that tackling the debt would be easy with a more dynamic economy. He even claimed that he could pay off the debt after eight years in office. This rhetoric aligns with the official GOP platform, which calls for a strong economy and spending restraint to pay down the national debt. But since then, Trump's views may have changed. His most recent economic plans include $1 trillion in infrastructure, as well as $5 trillion in tax cuts, and they could increase debt by anywhere from $5.3 to $11.5 trillion. He's also said that the U.S. will never have to default because it can simply print money. How Trump will choose to deal with the debt is a big question, and only time will tell if his actions will make America great again. For more quality content on business and investing, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.